All right, welcome back. Now in this video, this is going to help you save a lot of money, you'll make a lot of money, and um, I think this is going to make selling merchandise so much easier. And every day I get hit up from coaches that are like, hey, I wanna sell shirts to my client. What's the best way I can do this? And this is the best way you can do it. One of my clients last week messaged me. He um, did this exactly step by step. This is exactly what I told him to do. And I want you to just do this, all right? If you're gonna sell any hoodie or hat or socks or shirts, all right? It, this is incredibly simple, all right? Now here's step one, all right? I'm gonna give you four steps. Step one, just go to canva.com. You can create a free account. And you can, if you, like, let's say you just are like me. You, you hate doing logos. You are not a creative person. Um, go to Canva, right? Find a logo there and just, like, put your stuff on there, right? You can easily find a, a logo there. You can uh, edit it, make it look like your own. It's free, right? I think that should take you less than 20 minutes. So if you know what your logo wants to look like, go there, get it set up, all right? Then you text your clients and literally say this word for word. Hey, I'm making a limited amount of shirts for the players and parents in our program. And you know which size would you guys like or which size is, all right? And then attach a photo of the logo that you have onto a shirt, right? You can go to Google and just type in like black shirt and then like grab the file, take it to Canva, put the logo on it. Like this, this stuff is not hard, right? Um, so you send them a photo with that text. Uh, you could say which size or which size is, would you guys like, all right? They'll respond and you can say, great. All you need to do is pre-order these uh, on this website here, all right? So send them a form to just collect the money, right? And because they already told you what sizes they want, you, they don't need to go to the order form and pick the size. Like they, they've already done that. So you just have a notepad, you write down, all right, this is, here's how many that the, the shirts they want, here's the sizes. And then on the order form, you can add quantity on the order so they can say how many shirts they want. And this would be good because like, if you do it that way, parents will probably buy shirts for themselves or hoodies for themselves too, right? People want to support your business. Uh, where it becomes difficult, right? And I'll explain this why on the fourth step, but where, where this becomes difficult is like when you buy all the stuff up front and it's sitting in your car or sitting at your house, you feel like you just have to give it away for free. What I'm telling you to do here requires zero money, right? Because what we're doing is we're collecting all of the money up front before you even get anything made. <laughs> right and that's step four is you've already made sales and you haven't even made the shirts yet <laughs> right you haven't even made the shirts yet so what we do is we take the money right then we go get the shirts go to someone locally um this this comes down to, to like pure negotiating right but go to someone locally and you already have all the money for the shirts at that point you could charge 20 to 30 dollars per shirt if you want and you could probably get those shirts made for like eight to ten dollars per shirt right in this way you don't have stuff sitting in your car like you're only getting those orders made for people who have already paid for them right so again it's a much different process than most coaches do they they'll sit around you know have all these shirts all the all these all this merch in their car for years and then they're like oh i just need to get rid of it now and it becomes a huge waste of money so instead sell it don't even create it yet. Sell it, right? Show them what they're getting and have them pay for it. And then we take the money and we flip back and we go buy the thing from someone locally, all right? And then we just give them to our clients, right? It, it, this is really easy if you do it that way. And it puts absolutely zero risk on your shoulders. Because like, let's say you send this text to everyone and then no one responds. Well, then I would probably call everyone, right? Or I would or I would tell all the kids at, at the next session, hey, I'm coming out with a shirt. Like, would you guys want one? Here's, here's a photo of what it's gonna look like. And then they'll go tell their parents, they'll sell it for you, right? So do this, this will save you a lot of time, a lot of money. Uh, one of my clients, 
uh, reported back to me last week. He sold over two thousand dollars worth of merchandise, um, and what he did is he took all the funds to the store and he got everything printed out and he got everything done within a week. He got everything back to his clients and he generated an extra thousand dollars in his business, which is great, right? He could have like, if he did it the other way, he could have bought everything, been in the hole and then had to go flip it and, and go sell it, right? This takes a lot of the stress off your shoulders when you do it this way. So I hope this helps. Anytime you're going to sell anything in the future, like try it this way. Um, I think you'll see a massive, massive difference. That's it for the video. If you want other business building strategies and uh, you want to get to the next level, text me at my phone number, 210-960-5771. That's it. And have a great rest of the week. Hit the subscribe button if you're brand new to this channel. And uh, I look forward to the next video. All right. See you later.